Hey wonderful people, good afternoon from Dhaka, Bangladesh. You are here back again and I believe I am doing a fragrance review more like initial impression today from the house of Fogg. So this house basically is uh, from India and I have done quite a few Fogg fragrances but they have a plenty more, there are like hundreds out there. So the ones that I got to try, I reviewed them in the channel. Basically for people who live in subcontinent and people who are from India, Bangladesh, Pakistan who use, who know this fragrance, who have access to these fragrances. So they have basic uh, body spray line. They have uh, kind of like a uh, little bit more upper class, like not upper class, I would say a little bit more pricier. The body sprays come in like uh, $1, $2 price range about that. I think, uh, no, not $2, $3 price range. Then they have like $5 to $8 like perfumes. Then they go up 15 and the highest I've seen so far, I think it's 20 Five to thirty dollars US dollars. So basically, the fragrance are thirty dollars range. They have EDP concentration, hundred ml, thirty ml, fifty ml, different kind of bottle sizes. So they have plenty of out there. But uh, Fox should definitely develop a website at this present moment. They have a lot of users, so it's difficult for people to track down these fragrances if you do not have a legit uh, website. They have Facebook page in Bangladesh, different countries. So today I have four new fragrances. These are released just before the Eid. I saw them and I was bored during that time. There was like no nothing to do much. I saw them in one website. I bought them off all four. These are the white collection in a white bottle collection. So today it's uh, I just received a while ago, about half an hour back. I just put them once in my skin and I'm doing initial impression just to give you some idea. Probably I'm not gonna keep these. Uh, I just wanted to put the review out there and <laughs> that's why I wasted some money and probably also sell it off afterwards. But uh, let's see what you get and people perhaps we'll look into this house after seeing the review. That's the whole idea, right? So another thing, thanks a lot for people who are asking me in different pages and stuff. If I'm okay, there was a big uh, fire breakdown in Bangladesh somewhere. It, it's happening a lot because nowadays it's very hot and humid. So fire breaks out very, very fast. So uh, we have an area called Mirpur. So there are like a slum there. Uh, I think there was an electricity failure or electricity line problem, which is where the fire started. Like lot of people lost their homes okay and uh, it's a big tragedy uh, i don't know how many lives lost but it was a big tragedy but with uh, sadness you know extreme sadness i see people under those posts you know people who are asking concern about me trolling this thing you know like hey hope the fragrance police is all right like referring to me or someone saying by the fireplace guys you know you have families too right what if tragedy is struck you know and people go like you know, when your families die and your family members die, your children die and everything, would you, would you, would you like it if I do that, like scent of the day, you know, ha ha ha. You know, those are things devils would do, like devil kind of people, devil worshippers would do. I think humanity is sometimes not present with some deep shit people out there. I'm sorry to say harsh language, but it's not about me. It's about humanity and how insensitive people nowadays are. So I'm sorry for your birth, actually, those people who are writing this stuff. Uh, hope bad things happen to you <laughs> all right i'm sorry to say this but i'm not really happy about that anyway so let's start i have uh, four fragrance all together i'll do four in one video all right so first one i'm gonna go from left side okay this is called dazzle these are 100 ml edp concentration i believe um it should be edp is always i'm sorry i didn't see it because it's brand new yeah edp concentration and it says all the packaging will include this dude <laughs> it looks a little bit uh i don't know scary and uh, dazzle blue for uh scent and it will say 100 ml here okay blue and black combo so this is the bottle they have the picture of the bottle that's very nice touch up there they have the logo uh side it continues the dude's face is like this oh that's scary even more scary and bottom nothing much this fragrance is in india 600 rupees and bangladesh they are selling for mrp 799 i'm sorry the camera is not picking it up it's about 800 taka 900 taka for 100 ml so a little bit more pricey than their other 100 ml okay this is the box so what i'm going to do is i'm going to spray them on paper okay this is how that bottle looks all of them same and sorry it have the blue and white very nice clean looking bottles very nice and the fog is raised it says uh, dazzle fog scent their uh, logo the cap doesn't have much it's an edp and i think you put it led against it i think in the dark room you can see the juice moving inside juice level it can be seen and bottom it has a uh, this they have some sticker it says uh, MRP for details see inside open from here you have to open this I don't want to open that anyway so they put the production date as uh, 2018 okay 
last year's release but we're just getting it so this one kind of reminds me of hugo boss bottle unlimited bottles to be honest side by side i'm just showing one bottle exact same bottle shape even the caps caps a little bit different but bottle is exactly the same so let's try the first one it's called dazzle see if it dazzles us all right atomizer let's see the atomizer atomizer is good it has nice sort of mist okay it, it does have a good distribution the cap it's not snug fit but uh, like it doesn't click on but it's snug fit you can pick it up so okay this one i think the first one i saw in one of my group one of my brothers who bought this one before eid he said he bought it from somewhere and he really liked it and he said he's getting kind of like invictus hawa sort of vibe it's really really pleasant it's very beautiful scent actually to be honest if you smell it it doesn't smell like a fog perfume to be honest i never smell anything uh, like this from fog house so far small bottle big bottle different collection it smells like a very nice designer perfume okay it smells a lot like those it's not hawas exactly but it has the fruity aquatic oceanic breezy sort of feel it's kind of like how to say musky as well a little bit but the fragrance is very pleasant very safe if you do like invictus and hawas this is perhaps the same family like where the aquatic sweet fragrance would be but not uh, same clone as invictus this is i would say more uh, pleasant than invictus it's kind of light it's kind of light in a sense that the fragrance it's not like super sweet you know even like hawas for that matter is very sweet even though that's lighter than invictus or invictus aqua this is lighter than those but it has own characteristics so far i'm really liking it this is really 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 nice this is very beautiful if you like fruity aquatic uh, musky clean sort of scent this is this is definitely going to be favored by you i think this is one of the better ones from the line so far the first one it's a win i'll give this initial impression performance i cannot say i think this is a good performance because fog usually have very good lasting power on your clothes and skin both but i would suggest use this on your clothing just to be on safe side you know i hear stuff but i usually do not get anything on my skin problem but I, just to be on safe side just use them on your shirt really really beautiful for the smell and everything i'll give this initially 9 out of 10 very beautiful scent okay so this is called dazzle all right so moving on to the next one it's called fame this is red same like red uh, fog fame the dude's face again same fog written here it's raised up there it's the same box basically just the colorations are different price will be mentioned here in rupees and taka like that and the bottle looks like that on the box okay so these bottles are all same basically as i told you this is how that bottle looks red band here fog fame and then fog is raised glass bottle plastic cap okay bottom again the same so when you open it it's kind of snug fit you can easily pick it up without any worries okay so let's try this on the paper. Oh. Atomizer is everywhere. <laughs> okay. Let's turn it and spray it. I think the sprayers all same. Okay, let's go two sprays. Always when you spray a perfume, especially on the cheaper side, always make sure you give it some time on the air. You know, in the air, even if it's on your skin or paper, okay? because it's highly likely sometimes there'll be alcohol involved that can go straight to your system. It's not a pleasant experience. Okay. This smells uh, familiar. Uh, the red one, the fame. Uh, it smells like something I smelled before from the House of Fog. It's kind of like uh, the red bottle. I think it was Sultan or Prince. I do not remember. There was a perfume. Hold on. See if I have it around me. Uh, don't think I have it here. Uh, uh, no you know the perfumes that i bought from this series the, there's a red one like uh i think this sultan so that was a prince if i'm mis not mistaken so this fragrance smells something similar to that but i think it's a uh, not exactly similar but the fragrance uh, dna is same it's kind of like a warm kind of like the red kind of if you think of like a red kind of ruby red warm sort of feel maybe there's lavender in this okay lavender aromatic kind of like a fog typical uh, dna kind of a scent 
I think I like the previous one better if I compare. Yeah, previous one was much more unique. This is not that unique, but this is a pleasant scent once again. It's like, a, how to say, you can wear it casually, sporty sort of a smell, or kind of like work. And then I think there's some sort of uh, peppery note in this, kind of like spicy also. So red, spicy, fruity, and lavender kind of a feel. If you like Mont Blanc Legend, I think it's not exactly that way, but if you like Legend, that kind of scent, this is in that same way. So Fog Fame scent, the second one. For the scent, uh, it's not bad, but it's not unique. So I'm giving this seven out of 10, okay? So Fame from Fog Scents. So longevity, once again, I cannot tell because it's just been one hour, okay? So one win, one is okay. Now, moving on to next one, it's going to be the two <laughs> left these are names kind of funny i'll tell you why and uh, not just this bottle look like you was bottle unlimited uh their names this next one is called icon okay icon is from dunhill if you know dunhill icon they have done icon absolute and then dying icon was the other one elite the next one is called elite also <laughs> so i think they took the name but it cannot be too sure green green uh band with the white bottle icon edp 100 ml same dude and the prices are written same way same boxes okay just color is different and this is called icon and the paint has come off a little bit here but n nothing serious uh, so this uh, fragrance uh, let's see how this one goes the cap it's not fit once again let's spray this good sprayer very very good spray i must admit this has very good distribution and the spray is of high quality even the perfume is kind of on the cheaper side Oh, wow this is very strong this is very very strong this is even stronger than the previous two okay yeah this is this is definitely definitely stronger i think i'm getting strong presence of cardamom which is making me smile it's kind of on the green fresh oh yeah this is very live lively alive sort of fragrance it's very youthful you sniff it if you let's say a little bit of uh, sleepy or hungover this fragrance goes to your system, you wake up immediately. And it's not in a bad way, I really like this. This is very much like mint, paper, uh, peppermint, you know, like the chewing gums, Wrigley's, I think, those chewing gums with the green color. This has that mint, sort of like a mint, uh, vanilla and kind of cardamom combo, but uh, it's kind of not really realistic sort of cardamom. But the mint is definitely prominent. It's very much like a spearmint bubblegum kind of a smell, okay? So it's clean, fresh, like this white color. Uh, it's going to cool your mouth, it's cooling. Like this mint in toothpaste and the chewing gum makes your mouth kind of cool inside, cooling sensation. This fragrance is gonna do that for you. This is gonna be definitely a strong performer. I can tell it right from the first impression because the other two, the they were not as strong as this one. So definitely, this is a nice perfume. This is a very nice, uh, you can, since it's mint, so you can call it like kind of greenish, uh, spicy with that cardamom kind of fragrance very masculine kind of aftershave like very very manly and sporty scent and this is going to be definitely good for work and it will last you probably a long time in the daytime so yeah this is this is good to them. i'm going to give this nine once again uh, because the first one i liked for the smell this one has added let's call it nine and a half because it has stronger presence so this is icon by fog this fragrance it's i think perhaps the strongest in the line let's see the last one okay so the last one as i told you downhill icon they have elite and absolute this is called elite from fog so it's okay no problem names can they are not copyright materials anyone can take any name another thing is they have a uh, opening here okay but this thing it does look like you can open from here but no you have to open like from there inside uh, nothing much i just want to show you box is nothing much but well packaged you know nice decent decent packaging for price it's very very good and uh, they have once again the price everything written the information bottom okay this is called elite let's try the elite one elite bottle looks like that it's black and white combo okay glass bottle once again plastic cap production date here and then the cap easily can pick it up so let's see when, what happens when you spray this sprayer is it as good as the other ones yeah you bet <laughs> so this fragrance okay oh 
okay oh this is this is again light and very pleasant yeah this is this is familiar to me as well this fragrance smells like one other that i have i think this is very similar to tycoon the one they have the blue color one uh, this one i reviewed before tycoon is fruity fresh kind of like blue out of shower feel let's see if i get the same thing again okay not really same but in the same vein you know like if you like blue fragrances this is actually in the blue genre aquatic watery fresh out of the shower like dior sauvage family but it's not dior sauvage clone you can get hints of bleu de chanel from this but again not bleu de chanel clone it has its own smell okay so it's a very fresh fruity you know it's like you know like children they have their um, body soap not really body soap like shower gel they use the kids one johnson johnson they have the toy themed ones you know like the blue colored ones they have a lot of tutti fruity bubble gum sort of smell um let's say fruits they have different kind of fruits mango uh, apples berries strawberries uh, this smells like those mix of fruits like tropical very tropical kind of uh, juicy kind of a smell coming from it so i'm very i'm liking this a lot this is not as prominent as the previous previous one but this is definitely good in the high heat this is going to do really really well it's not choking it's not like a heavy thick musky sweetness this is like a fruity aquatic light like blue skies blue skies and white clouds you know like sunny day this is the kind of fragrance i think anybody can wear as a matter of fact all those fragrance fragrances anyone can wear any age no problem um uh, but highly likely this fragrance i'm going to do really well for summer and winter time i'm going to get even better performance so if i keep these fragrances you know i'll update it like later but highly likely i'm just going to sell them off because i have a lot of fragrances to uh reach for and finish but i just wanted to review them so basically this one the elite one is also very very nice i'm giving this 8.5 out of 10 all right so none of them are actually bad the one that got uh, kind of like fame this one is i gave it 7 because it's kind of familiar with the previous ones but it's not bad also any of these you get you can give it a try but my favorite ones should be the rest of the three they are really really good other three are really good this three elite icon and i believe this one is dazzle so you can try them all and uh, see if it works for you thanks for watching guys and this was just initial impression if i find something else i'll update in next video take care guys i'll see you soon have a very nice day bye bye